The Gully project started with an idea that Oxford City Council had a few years back as part of their Go Ultra Low Oxford project, where they trialled a channel for EV cables at residential addresses. That was successful, and so we decided to take the project forward. The, the project itself is to deliver a solution for people that don't have access to a driveway at home. Around 30% of UK households don't have access to off-street parking, which is a huge barrier to EV ownership. So our project has focused around creating a very simple channel that carries the cable across the public highway to your car so that you can charge at home. There are lots of benefits of that, but mostly for the resident, it's that they can access their cheaper at home electric rates. I was lucky enough to be part of a first trial back in 2017, which was being run by Oxford University and Oxford City as well. So Gully 1.0 was as simple as it comes, I think. It was, it was essentially just a, uh, a, a little gully that you just put your cable in. There was nothing to it. It was very narrow. This one has got extra sort of slip protection so that people can't slip on it. It's got the brushes which make a big difference because it A, it holds the cable in uh, and B, it actually makes sure that things don't necessarily fall into the trench in the same way. The installation process was really easy actually. I was contacted with a date that they wanted to do it. I was told it was going to be very quick. It was very quick. Some guys turned up, I moved my car and they very quickly dug a trench, put the cable gully in and sealed it all up again and we're gone within two hours. Gully 1.0 was what gave me the confidence to get an electric car. So I wouldn't have bought an electric car had I not had the gully. I charge almost exclusively at home now, which gives me lots of benefits, not least convenience, uh, but also uh, cost-wise, it's a huge, it, it's huge. It's such a simple solution. It's n there's no hassle in installing it. People sometimes worry that neighbours will frown on it or think you're trying to claim the space outside your house. I've had the exact opposite experience. Neighbours have been really interested. They've asked me about questions about my EV. They're really interested in getting one themselves. It's a positive, it, it really is a positive, um, and I can't see negatives with it.